Thomas Hart Benton's masterpiece, Persephone, updates the Greek myth about a sleeping goddess who's kidnapped and taken to the underworld. Benton always intended it to be here at the Nelson. That was the prediction two years ago. I would hope it would end up at the Nelson. Yeah. That's why it's here on indefinite loan right now. A last minute purchase of $2.5 million saved it from a competitor. The Nelson trustees had to act quickly. This painting is important not only because it's the universally acknowledged masterpiece of Thomas Hart Benton, it's a very important landmark in the history of American painting in general. And because of his association with Kansas City, uh, there's all the more reason that this painting had to be saved. Persephone was painted at the Art Institute in 1939. Around the nude are reminders of this area. The hay fields, the wild flowers, and the old farmer who is really Benton himself. Once the painting was controversial and hung in a New York saloon, now it's come into the light. According to Greek mythology, when Persephone is in the underworld, the earth mourns in winter. Well, here in Kansas City in winter, we have cause to rejoice because Persephone is back home, where she belongs here at the Nelson. I'm John Tibbetts for KCTV 5.